Hello everybody and welcome to Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge Part 17. It's gonna start right after I give you this little message. Uh, I kinda screwed up and I forgot to turn record my mic, the, the record your mic setting on Fraps off. So when I made this video I actually had two recordings of my own voice and when they were because I had the camera recording and the Fraps recording. So w when they overlaid, it was like a really annoying-ass echo. So I didn't know what to do, so I just deleted the sound to the the game sound. And then I rewatched it, and it was really quiet because it was just me talking. So I was like, ah, it's missing something. So what I did was I went and I got a whole bunch of Pokemon music and put it in the background to play nice and quietly, just so there's there's some sound so that it doesn't it's not completely silent and weird. So yeah, thank you for understanding. Might be won't happen again. Pinky prom? Well, I can't promise you it could happen. So until next time, this is peace. But of course, I'm about to say hello and like you know right when I'm done. So yeah, bye bye and uh, hello I guess. Hello everybody and welcome back to Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. Last time, uh, we caught a Dragonite and we caught a Skarmory back to back. Finally, the gods have shined upon me. The luck gods, the gods of luck. I don't even know if there's a god of luck. There probably is. I don't know his name though. I gotta find out. But he decided to be a pretty cool guy and um, granted me dudes with wings and oh my god. Captain Cox. He's a strong motherfucker. Well, actually, I have no idea. Let's find out. Prevents flinching. Nice. Nice. I can do that. Leer, Thunder Wave, Twisted Drag Race. So he's not, you know, ultra powerful, sexy mofo yet. But he, I, I will get him there. Have no fear. We will get sexy mofo. I don't know what he learns. I didn't check. But we will. But he can learn, like. A shit ton of TMs and stuff, so yeah. We might have to hit up that, uh. What the fuck it's called? I don't know what it's called. I can't think. Oh, little bitch might die to a Starmie. Oh my gosh. Fuck you, Starmie, you asshole. You're seriously not gonna let me escape? Oh my fuck. Piece of shit. Put your ass to sleep. Yeah. Yeah, you like that. This is actually kind of scary. Oh, please. Fucking just die. Oh, my God. Oh, I have potions. What am I doing? I'm stupid. Fucking... Are you kidding me? What a dick. What a dick. You know what I'm going to do? You know what I'm going to do? You know what I'm going to do? What I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to put it back to sleep and I'm just going to run. I'm going to try my best to run. There we go. And thank god, fucking dick. Starmies can suck in my balls. An Ariados just chilling in the middle of the ocean. It's very very interesting. I don't even know what I was talking about. I need to get back to the Pokémon Center cuz my dudes are hurting. Yes, indeed. Now, I'm not sure where exactly we're going. I know we're just going down this river and uh, seeing where the where, where life takes us. I'm not sure what the next town is. I'm not sure of anything. The only thing I'm sure of is that I'm unsure of anything. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. That's some deep shit right there. I just dropped some fucking like philosophical crap on you. And Ariados, this would be a terrifying place to swim if there were fucking just spiders everywhere. These must be these must be replacing tentacles. Found a protein, useless. Fight me, whore. Yeah. The sea is my backyard. I'm not gonna take you because you're a kid. Bitch! I don't think you can claim the whole ocean. I'm not a fucking president. I'm not a lawyer. I'm not a judge. I don't know anything about legal matters, but I'm pretty sure you don't own the ocean. I'm pretty sure it's not your backyard. So, what a dumb bitch. And plus, you have a Wilmer, and you're about to get raped by a little bitch. Yeah, that's right. Crit. That's right. Little bitch just rape pooped on you. I'm not going to say rape. Rape jokes aren't funny. They're just wrong. And, and, and tasteless. 
And you know what? I should be I should be ashamed. <laughs> I should be ashamed. Okay, another Dragonite. Probably the worst thing that could happen is getting like unable to run away from one of these. Because that'll suck. Um, I guess we're just gonna. Uh oh. I am going the right way, right? Please tell me I am. So I am not even. Oh my gosh. Move like three feet. Please be something good. You know, I'm not gonna lie, it's kinda looking like I'm not. I'm gonna take a gander at my, uh. at my Pokenav. Look at my Hoenn map. Okay, so blue is where we haven't been, right? Oh no, blue. Never mind. No, it's not. Oh, fuck, I don't know any of these. Fortree? I don't think I've been to Fortree. I'm lost as a motherfucker right now. Maybe I sa maybe I sail across right there. Let's try that, because it doesn't look like I'm actually going anywhere good right now. Grimer? Badass. Okay. Get me out of this fucking river. Oh my gosh. This is getting really old. Alright. We probably should st nah, there's nothing at this Pokemon. Never mind. Okay. So what is going on over here? Hey, Old Dale Town. Now if I go up here and sail here, let's see where this takes me. Can I catch anything here? I don't know. Wait, what route am I on? Route 103. Is this a different route, or is this still 103? I think this is still 103. I don't think I can catch anything here. And if I can, well, I just fucked it up. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a second. I know, I know where we are. I don't want you guys to worry. I, I know what I'm doing. Oh my god, I'm so lost. What the fuck is Marvel City? I don't even know. Have I been there? I'm, I think we have to go this way. I'm pretty sure. Let's look at the badges. Hold on. I don't, I don't want to look at my badges. Booty. Oh my gosh, that didn't tell me shit. Alright, yeah. Ye, I, I'm pretty confident. Sorry, somebody was outside. I don't see who that was. So fuck it. We're going to hop on Cycling Road here. There's going to be some trainers. I think they're all a bunch of weaklings. Down, down, da, da, down, down, down. This guy's going to want a battle. Nope, no he's not. Alright, cool. Alright, so we're just going to have to fly through these bikers because a million of them are going to want to fight me. <laughs> Level 6! Oh my god. This is going to be ridiculous. Definitely gonna have to just cycle through all these as fast as possible. Oh, now it's level 14? Talk about inconsistent. Encore, bitch! Yeah, that's right! Wait, no, that's just annoying. Why'd I do that? No, no, he's just gonna keep doing it! I shouldn't have done that! I'm I am, I am stupid. I am straight up dumb. You know, I'm not gonna lie, that Magnemite kinda fucked me up a little bit. Oh boy. Alright, little bitch. This will be a good workout. No. 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 Don't send them out against a Magnemite. That is, that would be really, really stupid. I was thinking about training Skarmory, and I was like, wait a minute. He'll die. I don't want him to die. I want him to live. 
And little bitch is becoming kind of, kind of not so little bitch. You know what I'm saying? Sorry, my hands are sweating so bad. That's what happens when I get when I hardcore game. You know what I'm saying? Fuck you. Don't panic if your bike's going fast. What kind of advice is that? You're fucking magnemite. Don't panic if you get fucking, like, destroyed in a Pokemon battle. Ha <laughs> ha! Sure told him. The reason I changed that to such a bad joke is because I was about to say something that I, I was kind of second-guessing myself. I was kind of like, nah, nah, maybe I shouldn't say that. In case someone has, like, post-traumatic stress disorder. Probably shouldn't say that. That, and it's just in poor taste, you know? And I'm not about that life. I am not about that life at all. So, on a scale of one to a billion, how pointless was going on this? Incredibly pointless. Okay. So this is going to be, this episode is going to be running around like an asshole. Oh, wait, no, this is where I wanted to be. Oh, 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 let's talk to this guy. Watson, oh, booty, you look like you have a lot of zip. That's a good thing. Well, I'll find up deciding your favorite booty mama says. There's a new mama. Booty, I'd like you to go there and switch off the generator. The generator has been running a bit haywire. It's getting unsafe. Here, this is the key to get into new Marvel. Yeah, this is this is what we're doing. Yeah, baby. I don't remember what you get from doing this. But I have the potential to catch a new teammate. And, uh, yeah. I'm all about that. I am all about that. So basically what we gotta do is we gotta go into this, like, abandoned, like, place. It's kinda creepy. And, uh, do what he said. Switch off the generator. I think we get a thunderstone? Or some, or some kind of evolutionary stone out of this, I wanna say. Fuck yourself, Zubat. Alright, here we are. New Mava, the door is locked. Use the basement key? Nah, 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 fuck it, and just leave. Obviously I want to use that shit. Alright. I might be able to catch some... We gotta press these little buttons and we open doors and shit. But some of them are actually vault orbs. Shelter? Huh. You know, Shelter's cool. I don't have too big a problem with Shelter. If if I can somehow get a Water Stone, which I don't know if I can. I gotta look look it up and see if I can. Uh, I will definitely um I will definitely turn this motherfucker into a cloister. Gonna take a little while. I'm just going to catch it anyway. i got to keep an eye on my health because it looks like I'm kind of dying. You know, I really thought that little bitch was just going to be like fodder for my team. I was just going to let him die, but he's grown on me, you know? Motherfucker keeps withdrawing. I don't even know if this thing knows anything good based on what I'm experiencing here. Alright, I never bought any more balls, so I may not be able to catch this. I only have three chances. Alright, that was pretty easy. It wasn't too bad. I would say, you know, catching something on the first try is generally a good thing. Shelter's data was added to the Pokédex. Bivalve Pokémon. It's because it's a clam. At night, it's burrow. it burrows a hole in the seafloor with its broad tongue to make a place to sleep. While asleep, it closes its shell, but leaves its tongue hanging out. Froze for a second. I got worried. That was weird. I was like, you didn't just freeze. <laughs> you didn't just freeze. I would have cried. All right.
Got it. Got the name already. That was that's a new record. I'm not gonna say why I thought this was a good name. I'm just gonna let you guys imagine it on your own, you know? Just try it, just think. Make up your own reason for why I named it this. Alright, so his name is gonna be Taco Buffet. Sounds good. It was put in the dead box, oh shit. Doesn't belong in there. Alright. Well, it looks like we didn't want that to happen. Fuck you, Ninkata. I wish I had found you instead. Can I walk? La leap. This is one. Snorlax! Hell yeah! Oh man, I wish I had found that. Oh, I wish I had found that. Holy shit! How do you how do you encounter a wild Snorlax? Like you're telling me they're lurking around these hallways? Like I'm pretty sure you'd see a fucking Snorlax. All right, to make this like a lot less awful, I'm going to use my repel. I don't think it's good for very many steps, but god damn, I'm really tired of these wild encounters. All right, I think I want that, like that, and then don't press that button. And now, see, here's what I'm talking about. This might be a vault orb. Oh, that one was an escape rope. I'm, I think there are always vault orbs. I don't know if that part's random. I'm pretty sure it's not. I'm pretty sure they're always the same. Ultra Ball? Hell yeah. You know what's funny is when I get Ultra Balls, I'm like, I don't want to waste them, but then it's like, what's the point of having them if I'm not even going to use them? Did I just run in a complete circle? I'm pretty sure I just ran in a complete circle. Yeah. That is confirmed. I did, in fact, run in a complete circle. Bloom! Badass. There's a lot of shit down here. Quillfish? Like... Why are there so many guys down here? I don't even know. Oh, boy. Alright, so we gotta go up here, I believe. Press that. Walk in here. Uh, okay, I know for a fact one of these is a Vault Orb. There's another crazy Snorlax just appearing out of nowhere. Creeping up on me, didn't see him. Oh, uh, looks like I guessed correctly. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, looks like I gotta fight him anyway. Yep, it is a Vault Orb, and why is the Vault Orb floating? Doesn't make any sense. Pretty sure Vault Orb can't float. That sonic boom did a lot of damage. I have no idea why, but it did. This is when the sonic boom doesn't do that much damage. What the fuck? Alright, let me put... Put Captain Cox out in front. I think Captain Cox is, uh... He may take over uh, uh, what Cucumber's position in the team is, and that's basically just destroy everything in sight. Okay. And bada bing. Now, for some reason, I strongly feel like there was, like, a Thunderstone or something. Fuck off, Ninkata, you bitch. Yes, it is! Ha! I knew my memory was correct! Alright. Bam. Stepped on the switch. Generator appears to have stopped. Alright, that's what I wanted, right? Cool. I don't even remember why he told me he wanted me to do that, but... His wish is my command! Alright. God damn it! Nothing but Zubat's here, too. Zubat is literally like the worst Pokemon you could encounter in a randomizer. It's like, really? Zubat, like, you see that shit all the time. 
You see those things all the time. Oh, ha, I knew it, Booty. I knew I'd made the right choice of asking you. This is my thanks. A TM containing Thunderbolt? Fuck yes. Oh my gosh. I want to teach it to little bitch, but I also don't, because I'm worried that I'll find... Like, if I find a better electric Pokemon to replace a little bitch, and I really don't want to not have Thunderbolt anymore. Alright, let's hit up the Mart real quick, and we will set sail. Gonna need a solid 15 of these. Oh, got a Premier Ball, hell yeah. I don't know what those things are equivalent to, but... No reason to be stingy with the moolah. Alrighty. Let's see, uh... Route 118. I really wish I had written down where I'd caught bitches. I might be able to catch something here. I think I can. I don't see why I couldn't. So let's do it anyway. Let's do it anyway. Persian. Hmm. Level 5. I mean, a Pokemon's a Pokemon, man. I like Persian. I love Persian, actually, but it's level 5, so it's really not too useful. Let me see if I can just catch this thing right off the bat. This would be badass. Because I'm pretty sure just touching this thing will fucking kill it. Yeah, fuck it. I don't give a shit. Fuck the Persian. <clears throat> a good rod is really good, wouldn't you agree? Hmm, we're of identical minds. Here, take this good rod. You see, don't you wish the world was just filled with more people like that? He's like, hey, you want a good rod? Yeah, there you go. Bam, I just got a fishing pole. I didn't do shit. Like, what, a, what, a, what a bro. Look at this, these guys again. Oh, your booty hide. Do you remember us from last time? Can you show us how much strength you have? Okay, Q interview. Let me blow them away with my... Intrinsic way of talking. I don't even know if that made any sense, but just nod and say it did. Yes, yeah, it made sense. Yeah, good job. Uh, Magnemite is really annoying. So let's just focus everything on the Magnemite, because I don't want him to, like, Thunderbolt Captain Cox. Captain Cox dies. I will be the biggest idiot to ever play this game. I'm already kind of stupid. I won't do me any favors. There we go. I like this music. All right. 364. Time to give them an interview. That was an intense battle. Did you get that on camera? As a matter of fact, I did. Aye! Remember? That's the quote you gave us as a battle clincher last time. I never ever forget stuff like that. Last time we battled, you stomped us before we could brace ourselves. Anyway, what do you think? Do you want to be interviewed again? Yeah, I do. Okay, I need you to describe your feelings about our battle, but it has to be short and sweet. Go. Adjectives. <laughs> Drooling. There you go. Mm, yes, that's the perfect clincher. I get the feeling that this will make a great TV show. There's a chance that it'll air on TV, so look out for us. Okay. So, what would you think? Drooling. Riveting. Riveting. Truly, truly an inspiration. Whoa! Hi, booty. It's me, Steven. We met in the cave near Duford. Have you met any kinds of... Many kinds of Pokemon since I last saw you? There are many kinds of Pokemon in this wide world of ours. If you wanted to raise only your favorites, that's fine. Perhaps you find it more fun to raise all sorts of Pokemon. As a trainer of Pokemon, what do you think? Of course, they're not going to any of my business. It'd be nice if we were to get, meet again somewhere. All right, you creepy fuck. Ah, shit, I mean to do that.
Shut the fuck up. Fisherman Barney, you fucking asshole. That's right. Alright, so. Just so we're clear. We are on the same route still. I really should have just caught one here instead of going into the water. I'm an idiot. Don't! It would have been a Bulbasaur. Okay, alright, that's cool. Yeah, that's alright. It's no big deal. Yeah. Try and make it past this motherfucker. Free Willy! Yes! Did it! Oh, Route 119! Okay, alright, we're at 24 minutes and something. So I'm gonna try and catch something right here, right now. Route 119, let's do this. I always like to end the video with something exciting. I'm not looking. It's a red ice! I love a red ice! That is nuts. I almost feel like it's cheating if I catch this. Don't get your hopes up, though. I really don't think I'm going to catch this. Oh my god, that move looks way stronger than it was. Holy shit. I thought Cucumber was dead. I thought that was it. I was like, <gasps> like no. Roger Ice, you dumb fuck. Holy shit. Okay. Let's go polychode. And we're gonna try and put it to sleep. Alright. Everything is going very well, <laughs> I'll say that much. Um, right, let's just start throwing my balls at it. Let's try Premier Ball, because this is a special occasion, right? I've never had a Premier Ball work in my life, so this probably won't. I've never even gotten a one shake, so that was honestly more impressive. You know, I think it's a good time for the Ultra Ball. Let's throw the Ultra Ball. Work nicely, work nicely. Almost had him. It's kind of weird. It's kind of bad. Not a good sign when the Premier Ball works better than the uh, Ultra Ball. I wonder if a water gun would kill this thing. Here's what I'm gonna do. Let's go, little bitch. Quick attack. I don't think will kill it. There we go. All right. Pokeball. If I catch this thing, I'm gonna have like the strongest team. Oh, gotta go back to uh, Polychode. Come on, baby. These episodes always end up lasting way longer than I was planning because shit like this happens. I'm not complaining, it's pretty awesome, but... Damn. You mofo! <laughs> Almost had him. Almost had him. Now, I know there's a solid chance now that we can catch him. I'm, I'm kind of out of things to say at this point. <laughs> Motherfucker. Alright, time for the great balls. Oh, good gracious. Great balls of fire. <laughs> Shit, I'm stuck. <laughs> great, now I have to fucking flag this video because I'm fucking shake my ass in the camera. I just got a red ice. What? How did I do that? I don't even know. Iceberg Pokemon. Its entire body is made of Antarctic ice. 
After extensive studies, researchers believe the ice was formed during an ice age. Damn! <laughs> That's awesome. All right. Oh, what should I name my reg ice? I fucking reg ice. You guys are jealous as fuck. Ah, uh, sorry, little bitch. <laughs> Looks like reg ice is taking taking over. And I got that thing a lot easier than I really feel like I should have. But whatever. Reg ice. You know, Sub Zero is a pretty good name, but I don't think it's really funny. Come reggae ice, because his name looks like. Actually, no, let's name him Jerry Rice. Fuck it, isn't that? I think that's a football player. I don't know. It just sounds kind of nice, so we'll call him Jerry Rice. Sounds good. Just because it just sounds ridiculous having a red ice <laughs> named Jerry Rice. Like it's just very. It doesn't look much like a Jerry Rice. So, well, that is a fantastic ending. Once again, I'm on a roll. I'm on a roll. So, until next time, thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video. Peace!